Well, when we think about, you know, Fallout and its future, obviously, you know, there'll be games in the future. In the near future, something that's brand new that we're super excited about is the, the TV show. A lot of movie producers and stuff would like, hey, we could, this would be a great, great movie. And for, you know, 10 years plus said no, um, just wasn't the right fit. It's fun to see, you know, it's, it, I'm glad that something, that an IP that I helped make has grown and has turned into this franchise. I mean, we're getting a TV show. So I've actually been blown away by how much they've, they've, they've stuck with our original visions and designs on the visual side uh, of, of, of our world building in the games, directly translating that to the screen. It's sort of, you know, it's reassuring that, well, well, we got it right the first time. Like our, our, our approach to Fallout is, was correct, and it is the way forward, even making the jump to another medium. You know, one of the people I've always wanted to do it was Jonathan Nolan. You know, I, I love the movies he's written and worked on with his brother and his TV shows with Lisa Joy and Westworld. And Jonah and I connected and was, you know, would this be something that would interest you? And it turned out he was a big fan of it. Can you tell us a little bit about Fallout? Fallout? Fallout the video game? I love video games. I'm not familiar with the Fallout. Tell me a little bit about it. Thanks, Adam. It's a video game. 25th anniversary is coming up in October. Fallout, Fallout. Yes, the post-apocalyptic, humorous, dark, bleak, brilliantly written, uh, annoyingly playable yeah, video how did game you, franchise. How did you get involved? Well, several years ago, I decided I was going to write the next great American novel. And then a friend gave me a copy of Fallout 3, and now I'm working in television. <laughs>